Today I'm going to be checking out an awesome free lightsaber plugin from Video Copilot. The first thing you need to do is download and install the plugin. I'll leave a link where you can download it free on Video Copilot's website. Once it's installed in After Effects, you just open it up and drag in your footage. Once your footage is in the timeline, right click and create a new solid. Now go over to the effects and search Saber. You should have a result from Video Copilot. Drag that effect on your solid and a lightsaber should appear. Now to remove the background, go to the blending mode and change it to screen. You can see a ton of awesome adjustments under the Saber settings. You don't have to do just a lightsaber effect, now there's options for electric and fire. Among the things you can adjust are color, glow intensity, glow spread, glow bias, core size, core start, and core end. Also there's flicker, distortion, and a ton more things you can mess with. The glow in this plugin looks super good. It spreads in and adds a nice atmosphere to the shot making it look very realistic. To start moving the lightsaber you just have to click the keyframe for the core start and core end. Now you just line it up with the top and bottom of your lightsaber. You can use the page down button to scroll forward frame by frame. And now you adjust the points to cover the lightsaber. Another cool thing this plugin does is add motion blur. So the more your lightsaber moves each frame, the more the light will cover the area, making it look more realistic. But once everything's set up, you just get to work matching the lightsaber. It takes a while, but it's still much quicker than any other method. But once you're done matching the lightsaber, you can turn your glow on and see the result. Which like these videos I'm going to show you didn't take much time, but still looks pretty awesome. Anyway, that's it for today. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you guys next week.